an object of 3 cm height. So, the height of the object is 3 cm. It is placed at a distance of 60 cm. So, the object distance is 60 cm. From a convex mirror of focal length 30 cm. So, the focal length of the given convex mirror is 30 cm. So, let us first understand the arrangement of the given parameters in this question. So, we have given a convex mirror having focal length 30 cm. So, this is 30 and 30 plus 30 and this is 60. And at 60, an object of 3 cm height is placed. So, in this case, the image formation will be somewhat like this. This is a diverging mirror. So, the light gets diverged. And here also the light gets diverged. And we need to extend backwards of these rays to get an image. So, from the ray diagram itself, we understood that the image is smaller than the object. It is formed behind the mirror or inside the mirror, which means that it, it was formed by extended rays or the image is virtual and also it is erect. They have asked to find out the nature, position and size of the image. So we got a rough idea about the question and using ray diagram to get a rough idea will be uh, better in answering the question or for making less errors. So now we will discuss its theory. The theory to this question is two different equations. One is mirror formula. 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u and in order to explain the nature of the image we need magnification so magnification m is equal to minus v by u so first we will use mirror formula to find out the position of the image so by mirror formula 1 by f is equal to 1 by v plus 1 by u we need v so we will move u to the other side. So, 1 by v is equal to 1 by f minus 1 by u. On cross multiplying, 1 by v is equal to u into 1 is u minus f into 1 is f by multiple product of the denominators u f. So, v is equal to, we will take the reciprocal on both sides, u f by u minus f. This equation can be noted as a shortcut. So, using that equation, we will find out the value of v. So, v is equal to before substituting the value, we should always assign the signs to the given values. The object is always placed erect. So, it is positive. The object is placed in front of the mirror such that the direction of light is in this direction and the object distance P O is measured in the opposite direction. So, whenever we make a measurement opposite to the direction of light, it is negative. So, it is minus 60 and for a convex mirror, for a convex mirror, focal length is positive. So, it is also positive. So, we'll substitute these values. Minus 60 into 30 divided by minus 60 minus 30. So, V is equal to minus 60 into 30 by minus 60 minus 30 is minus 90. Minus minus got cancelled. 33 times is 93. 20s are 60. So, the answer is 20 centimeter. So, this distance will be 20 centimeter. Now, we got the position of the image. Now, we need to explain its nature and size. To explaining nature and size, we will find out the magnification. So, magnification m is equal to minus v by u equal to minus v. The value of v is 20 by value of u is minus 60. So, it becomes 1 by 3. Minus and minus gets cancelled and it is 1 by 3 or 0 0.33. So, from this we can explain the nature of the image formed. Magnification is positive which implies that image is erect. If magnification is positive, the image is standing straight or erect. Or if the magnification is negative, it will be inverted. So we got that it is erect. And the object distance is positive. The 20 is a positive number. If object distance is positive, it means that the image is formed. The image is formed in the direction of light or behind the mirror. So it is behind the mirror such that it is virtual. 
so image is virtual also we will find out the size of image magnification by definition is height of image by height of object so on cross multiplying height of image is equal to magnification times height of object magnification we got it as 1 by 3 and uh, height of object is given in the question as 3 so 3 and 3 goes cancelled and becomes 1 centimeter so clearly hi is 1 centimeter and ho is 3 centimeter so ho is greater than hi so object is bigger and the image is smaller which implies that the image got diminished so we got the location of the image its nature as well as its size